care for your mother's bathroom. There's not an angle to do one's business without a clown figurine staring at you. That's why I said, yeah, that's why. You remember the Thanksgiving game when it snowed in Dallas? 1993, Leon Lett blew the game in the final seconds and the Dolphins emerged victorious. And then I finally got to do my calculus. I was so pissed I wanted to shoot my TV. So was my dad. And then he did. Anyone need a beer? Yeah. Thank God. So, does your dad still live in Texas? No, he died when I was 14. I'm sorry to hear that. So was the man who owned the local liquor store. He cried and cried. There you go. Oh, thanks. So if your dad died when you were 14, you were never old enough to have a beer with the man. No, sir. He did try to give me one for my high school graduation, but I was 11 and my mom said no. <laughs> Well, you're having one with me. All right. To your dad. I never had a beer with my dad. Either. Do you mind? We're having a moment here. That's all I can do without throwing up. <laughs> that is not what I expected when you said you were gonna burp pie. <laughs> Did somebody say pie? <laughs> I don't know what's scarier. The bathroom clowns are the woman that put them there. <laughs> all I know is you can only fit one of her in a car. <laughs> want to come here, but this is shaping up to be one of the best Thanksgivings I've had in a long time. Me too. <laughs> hey, Harry says you've been making fun of him all day. Now both of you apologize right now. She's so tiny. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny when she's mad. <laughs> all right, mister. I think you owe Howard and Bernadette an apology. Perhaps you're right. <clears throat> I'm sorry for my behavior. I've had alcohol and it's caused me to be inappropriate. Okay. Don't worry about it. Thank you. Ain't she great? <laughs> Sheldon. Now how's about you get us a couple of beers? <laughs> Yeah, everything was delicious. Well, I couldn't have done it without my two favorite girls. Martha Stewart and Rachel Ray. <laughs> hey, Sheldon, what do you say we go outside and throw around the old pigskin? This is a Jewish house. I don't think they have pigskin. <laughs> Did someone say pigskin? I am sorry about today. And I promise, next time I get married, it won't be a joke. It'll be for love. Or money. I'm sorry, too. Don't be. It's my fault. I was a terrible husband. I was never around. I know I'm hard on you. But you're not the worst son-in-law in the world. Mike, it's the nicest thing you've ever said to me. Well, I'm drunk. I just vomited on a lot of clowns. 